started our sales campaign over a year ago and we had to try to tell them what this place would be like. Uh, and uh, it's been a joy to see the smile on all their faces. Uh, everybody's excited and um, to me I get the satisfaction when they tell me that it was more uh, than they had ever expected. And uh, you know, they, you don't get that every day uh, with, with real estate developments. It's just beautiful. Everything from the clubhouse is beautiful, the pool, the landscaping, everything just looks wonderful. They really outdid themselves. The park is really nicer than we anticipated. I mean, they went beyond what they had told us they were going to do. I love being able to wake up in the morning, walk down to the dock, and throw a line out and do a little fishing. We, our love for water and our love for RVing, we, uh, we love to travel and uh, we live close by and this was just a perfect fit for us. Uh, the accessibility by boat as well as the motorhome to be able to stay here and enjoy this view. We, uh, we're very, very fortunate. Heritage was uh, a development that uh, represented something that we always wanted to have. Uh, we never thought we would really have it, and that was uh, water, view, and nice accommodations. They're trees. The trees. The trees are phenomenal. They're great. You know, so many RV resorts do not have trees. You sit here at nighttime with the brick paver streets and the coach slabs. It feels like you're going back in time, and the stress just kind of melts away. Well, if I had anything to say, it would be to say to the other owners that do sold me a wonderful place and actually what happened was he gave me more than I paid for. He, he lived up to everything he said and he gave me the best lot and the best value that I've ever bought. It's a wonderful place. I mean the views, you cannot beat the views, you're on the water. You can go and play all day or you can just sit here and relax and enjoy it. The park is friendly, the park is friendly to RVers accessible of in and out with, with large coaches is uh, it's the way the park was laid out each site is very accessible to get in and out of uh, it's, it's just a great layout we've been into other parks uh, we actually own lots in some other parks and this is the best this is definitely the best we've ever been in uh, no park that we've been in had any views of water like this park the sunset unique very unique yeah the underground infra, in, infrastructure here was amazing what they had to do for drainage and to get it prepared and, and the, the saved, and after pictures, I know, saved so many trees. Really you know, that was their goal amazing. to save as much green as they could, which was beautiful. And the beach we have here is excellent. The piers, uh, the dock, it's going to be uh, quite, quite a nice spot. Uh, we really believe that the developers uh, everybody that was involved in the process, um, everything that was told to us turned out exactly as it was, if not better. And uh, you don't see that very often, especially in a down uh, market like uh, this market is right now. Well, uh, I've been here all my life and this was a beautiful piece of property, but, but you've taken it and you've made it a community. And I, and I don't. I don't say that lightly. It really gives a sense of community when you walk down the street, when you come in. and When you move on this to this end of Orange Beach, this is the oldest part of Orange Beach. This is community. And y'all fit right in. It's perfect. The thing that makes it the most unique is uh, just the overall environment. This is not a 250, 300, 400 lot RV resort. You know, this place has only been uh, open. We've, we've had people here for less than a week and it's already like a, like a close-knit family atmosphere. There's only 79 units and 42 boat slips. So uh, it's, it's mainly the close-knit environment and uh, just the, the cozy setting that, that you know, having this type setting creates. 